making her way to the ring from New York. Guys, we talk so often about having a killer instinct, but this woman needs something even darker than that tonight. Indeed, Michael, you need to tap into something sinister, something primal. You are essentially putting them inside the object of their demise. Which begs the question, does this woman have the capacity to do just that tonight? A major match ahead of her. She plans on proving exactly why she's worthy of big matches like these. about having a killer instinct, but this woman needs something even darker than that tonight. Indeed, Michael, you need to tap into something sinister, something primal. You are essentially putting them inside the object of their demise. Which begs the question, does this woman have the capacity to do just that tonight? The following contest is a casket match. There are no pinfalls, submissions, disqualifications, or countouts. The only way to win is for a superstar to force their opponent inside of the casket. After closing the casket lid shut, the remaining superstar will be declared the winner. Now, let the match be. sinister matches in our industry. In order to win this match, you have to force your opponent into the casket and trap him inside. This match is not for the faint of heart. Just to get in the ring for this kind of contest takes a ton of guts. Well, there's no countouts or disqualifications in this match, so running away is still a viable strategy at this point. Tripling attack on the knee. Ah, oh, kick! Nasty kick. All the way up, the big time power bomb. Crashing down like that, having the wind knock out of you, never a good time for that to happen. Oh, the body's not meant to be stretched that way. We're gonna wear down their opponent. Oh, with the heel hook stretch. Measured elbow drop. And this match will head back to the ring. Oh, into the casket they go. Oh, no. Rest in pieces. Doing their best to... Oh, they did it. They survived for now. They're going to be breathing a sigh of relief. She will wisely return to the ring now. She's bringing the pressure on now. Momentum has clearly swung her way. Ooh, what a forearm club. She's forced onto the defensive now. Power slam. Corey, this match is so twisted. It can make a competitor motionless. What's the game plan for a contest like this? If you have a sadistic side, this is the night to bring it. Be the first to dissect your opponent. Make sure that you are the only person physically capable of shutting the lid on the casket. 
She turns it right around with a counter. She's also reversing the momentum on her. She was being tested, but now finally gets some offense of her own in. Jumping knee strike. I like that. Telling her opponent that she has even more left in her tank. She's taking this outside. This one cannot be lost by count out. In full control here. Ugh. Face first in the turnbuckle. Kick. Well placed kick. Oh, God. Plenty of hits coming her way now. In a corner. An effective attack to the leg can hurt everything from balance to mobility. It can drastically limit you inside the ring. She's taking things to ringside. A shovel? Don't use a shovel! I'm on their shoulders. Down in a hurry. She's getting back into the ring. This could be big. Going up high. You can see her struggling to find her bearings. From the top. Look out below. Took a leap of faith and connected perfectly. This could be just what they needed. position to be in right now. Dumped into the casket. Now slam the lid and this one's over. Trying to force... And they got out of the casket. Thankfully. And this one might be headed ringside. She's taking a beating here. And this match is not over yet. Things are only going to get harder from here. She's struggling to defend herself. Yeah, the faults in her game plan are being laid bare. Strength being shown here. As they're pulling it all almost into the casket, and now they are. All you gotta do is shut the lid. So take things into the ring. And no count outs means she has the whole outside to play with. She's going up. Top rope here. Soaring. And that might have been too erratic of a decision to take such a high risk at this junction of the match. Up top, Samoa Driver. Slowly getting up, but she won't like what she's met with. Lifting them up. There's a go to sleep. This is it. She's got her knocked out. Just got to get her into the final resting place and shut the lid. Well-placed elbow drop. Gets inside the ring. Sight set on the top rope. From the top. Wow, what a landing. Adrenaline can make you do crazy things. Exhibit A right there. She shoots up the top rope. Dangerous thinking. She has her target weighed and measured. Launching. Counter right into a power slam. Vicious headbutt. Now is as good a time as any to capitalize and get them into the casket. Yeah, but it's not going to be easy. They are completely out right now. She's getting back up, but she might be down again soon. From the top. You gotta be kidding. Taken out from high above. You gotta be some special kind of crazy to do that. Good timing with that reversal. A running elbow drop.
No telling what's underneath the ring tonight. There's no crying in baseball, gentlemen, but finding yourself on the receiving end of that bat might tell a different story. Man, that logo just got tattooed between their eyes. And that was a well-executed attack. So many dangerous attacks, one after the other, making it difficult to regain any composure. These competitors came out here poised and ready for a fight, and boy, are they delivering. Oh, knee smash in the face. And there she's dealing out even more damage. Yeah, she's able to unleash some hellacious offense to bring things to her favor. Just continuing to dismantle their opponent. Both wrists captured and man, knee strike. She throws her back in. Tossed into the casket. It's about to get very dark in there. Can they close the casket? But the, the opponent is trying to find Then they survive. I can't believe they actually made it out of the casket. All right, she's back in, ready to go. Over the top and into the casket. This is over, this is over. Trying to close the lid, trying, this is gonna be tough. It's not over yet. And they're able to fight their way out of the casket. They can't be human, that's ridiculous. Getting back into the ring. Muscle up for the gory special. Oh, wait, wait a second. Flatliner. Yikes. This could be the opening she needs to wrap this thing up. The only opening she needs to think of now is opening that casket and slamming it shut on her opponent. An extremely perilous position in which to find yourself. Oh, my God, even worse. All that happens now is the casket is closed and the... We've got a struggle on our hands to close the casket. They may survive. They're fighting back. Not ready to put the lid on this one yet. Apparently closing that casket is easier said than done. She re-enters the ring now. <laughs> That'll teach her to waste precious time in the ring. Double underhook. Power bomb. We're going swinging. I'm not going to lie. This is fun to watch. They are primed for the casket now. But after that move, do you have the energy to get them in? This arena has come unglued. You can feel the fountain. Trying to force the casket close to end this thing. There's no way they're going to prevent Doomsday here. Not ready to put the lid on this one yet. Apparently closing that casket is easier said than done. Oh, yeah, she is really showing her confidence. Look out. She heads out of the ring. Interesting strategy. Setting foot in the ring now. What? That was a stiff shot with the shovel. One wicked attack after another. And that was offense with a hurtful purpose. I don't care who you are. You can't take consecutive attacks like that without it affecting you. No surprise that what we're witnessing is trending. Forget trending on social media. The motion in the arena is charting on the Richter scale. This is a crushing amount of offense from her. The momentum is clearly turned to her favor. Uh-oh. Must have forgot what kind of match was going on for a moment. Deconstructing the knee there. 
Oh, using the rope to their advantage. Attacking the arm. Oh, look at this. This won't win the match, but it's doing a lot of damage in the... Trying to escape. Oh, it's a jawbreaker. Getting carried around. Bad spot to be in. An extremely perilous position in which to find yourself. Oh, my God, even worse. All that happens now is the cast. We've got a struggle on our hands to close the casket. They may survive. They're fighting back. Yeah. They may survive. I can't believe they actually made it out of the casket. Quick return to the ring. Outside, what's the plan here? Desperately trying to force the casket closed. Their opponent showing massive resistance. Yeah. And they're able to fight their way out of the casket. They can't be human. That's ridiculous. She's into the ring again. She's got her right where she wants her. Now get her into that coffin. The challenge now is to carry the dip out of the ring and into the casket. The end is near. Doing their best to try and close the casket. Just delaying the inevitable. They did it. They survived for now. You gotta be breathing a sigh of relief. Back in the ring now. She's got the whole WWE Universe. Ooh, she had enough of that. Rotating vertical suplex. Nicely done. Focused attack to her torso area. Striking with the knee drop. So precise. Beating down with a shovel. Straight pummeling them with it. Trying to close the lid, trying. This is going to be tough. It's not over yet. And they got out of the casket. Thankfully. 
With no count outs, there's nothing keeping her inside the ring. And back into the ring she goes. Oh, look at this, arm wrench. Greg wearing it with the arm wrench, very nice. She slips outside, what has she got in mind? Working their opponent's jaw like a speed bag and dropped. This is the time to get them in the casket and try to win this thing.